FNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of well right now is a non-rainy Delray Beach, Florida. This year, 11 a.m. update, and we got a mixed bag. The mix, uh, like yesterday, coming from the NASDAQ, which is up 32 points, NASDAQ 100, that is. Otherwise, the other U.S. indices are trading to the downside. Dow's off 209, S&P's down 16, Russell's off 33, Semi's 27, Trendy's down 316. We've got gold trade up 27 bucks, silver's up 13 pennies, lights recruit is off 6 cents, natural gas off 2 pennies, 30 year treasury up 22 ticks. She's printed out at 120.17. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart we begin with the es mini upper left hand side so it's a new profile it's attempting to form it is below price that's a bullish signal price this morning here testing in essence very close to the top 53.93 is the top of that profile we got down to 53.90 about <coughs> 53.98 so you want to watch that then now we won't get confirmation until sunday night uh, if this profile forms or not out there. Price also tests the oscillator and chains on. We'll see that. So support is held. There's no topping signal as we speak just yet inside of the ES Mini. Now, if it was able to poke its head above the high from uh, June 12th, two days ago, that high being 54, 54, 54, 50, then you would get a, a TD9 count top today. If we take a look at that spot volatility, you want to keep an eye on that. So far, it's been nothing more than a test and rejection of resistance, which was that uh, which was the 50-day uh, exponential moving average at 13.45. We actually traded up to 13.45. If we close above that, assuming it's on a 10% one-day rate of change, then we should see markets continue. And, that, and when I say markets, the S&P start moving lower. If we take a look at the NQ, the NQ doesn't have a clue as to what I'm talking about, although we are in a wave number seven top, uh, but that needs just simply a lower high today. Confirm that pattern out there. Um, otherwise, and no new profiles or anything there, the NQ looks like it wants to target 2151. U.S. dollar index is an A to B equals CD pattern of the upside. That assuming it closes above 105.06. Its next price target would be at the 106.15 level, and at 106.05 is the top of its uh, weekly profile. If we take a look at gold, uh, gold still holding support of its profile. This is a profile that wrapped around the prior profile. It suggests a consolidation pattern. Support at 23.14.40. Resistance up at 23.86. Silver uh, got down and basically tested the bottom of its profile. That is held. Uh, and lights we crude, you can see it's had a nice move, just dealing with some trend line resistance. If it can clear that trend line, it'll go target the center of its weekly profile at 79.71. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show. But if you're off to start your Friday, have a fabulous one. Have a fantastic weekend. And for all you fathers out there, a happy Father's Day. Take care. We'll see you soon.